Hey guys, a year ago today, I was 327 pounds, probably at one of my lowest points in my life, not full of energy, not full of confidence, or anything like that. Today, here on January 1st, 2021, I am now 68 pounds lighter and feeling the best I have ever been. Not where I want to be yet, but I'm hoping that in this year I can hit my 100 pound goal. So without further ado, this is what I look like. Hey guys. <laughs> Usually I do the whole, it's a new year, yes it is, and all this other crap. But um, this year I just want to sit down and just talk. Because, um, tell you the truth, I didn't think a year ago I would probably be in this situation. Because... A year ago, 2020, probably one of the worst years worldwide for many multiple reasons. But um, for me personally, this was probably a very successful year for me in retrospect because um, I'm 68 freaking pounds lighter. And honestly, it feels freaking amazing. Like, I just want to say thank you to all the support on my Facebook, Instagram, YouTube. It really means a lot to me because, like I said a year ago, I didn't have confidence within myself. I was at one of my lowest points. I was overweight. I was hurting after work. I could hardly sleep. I almost woke up in the middle of the night most times just because I couldn't breathe or it was just too hot. And I, and I just, I was at a low point. I, I did not feel happy with myself. And then when I went to the doctor... Oh my gosh, I was got I I was put into shock therapy because um, I was told that um, if I didn't change my ways, if I didn't you know like do something, I possibly would have gotten diabetes, high blood pressure, and all a whole bunch of other health problems. So that was the shock therapy I needed. So um, after I got done with the doctor's office, I. At first, I was upset at myself because I, re I, I really screwed myself up. I should have not gotten myself overweight in the first place. And it took me a while to finally just get my mind right, get my confidence up. And when I first got a scale to check my weight, and I noticed that like in the first month, I lost like 16 pounds. I'm like, what? Like, what just happened? And just to see the weight just grinding off like that made me feel good because like I said I had no confidence a year ago I was just in a dark place I I hid my pain behind smiles basically if you guys saw my weight loss trailer video I will be making a weight loss video when I hit my 100 pound goal I promise you that once I hit my 100 pounds I will start making the video it's just crazy to me because I didn't think I would be 70 pounds lighter to tell you the truth and just knowing that I had family and friends back me up and just like be behind my back the entire way I'm truly grateful I'm truly thankful for all my friends my family and all the support I've been given I've been getting it really means a lot to me I'm trying not to get emotional because I've tried to film this two times now and I almost cried on the last one I'm trying not to cry now because it just it's it's tough to talk about because weight loss is hard. I, I don't think anybody realizes, but losing weight is one of the toughest things you can do in your life. Like It is so tough to do. And I'm not where I want to be yet, but I'm hoping in 2021, I can get to my 100 pound go. I'm 259 pounds now, 68 pounds. That just blows my mind that I was able to do that within a year. And I didn't think I had the confidence within myself. If you guys go and watch my last New Year's video and this one right now, you guys can probably tell the difference immediately. I can even tell the difference in pictures and I almost cried. Because I was just like, why did I do this to myself? But I'm very, I'm very grateful for everything. I am very grateful for my friends, my family, and all the support that I've been given. It, it just truly amazes me that that I had support this entire time and 
it makes me feel good that I wasn't alone in this. So I want to say thank you to everyone from the bottom of my heart. It truly means a lot to me. And I really hope you all stay by my side within the year 2021. And next year, when we get to 2022, I'll be over 100 pounds lighter. And I'm hoping to be close to 200 pounds even. I'm hoping. Uh, this last month was probably the worst because <laughs> holidays. Because Christmas, New Year's, just been eating bad. But hey, that's just life in general. I'm hoping by 2021, I, I'll i be close to 200 pounds even, and I'll be in even better shape than I was a, a year from now. So, I know I'm rambling on and everything, and I got family out there that I want to celebrate with. And also, Super Sector 24 as well. Shout out to him. He's been, he's been by my side. Thank you. Thank you, Alex. Love you, man. Thank you so much. You are a true friend, and don't you ever forget that. I know you're going to be watching this video later. <laughs> but anyways, guys, I know I didn't do the whole It's a New Year thing, but I just wanted to keep it somber this year. I wanted to keep it light. I'll be doing that next year. Trust me, it'll be back next year. I just wanted to keep it light and simple with you guys. So thank you guys for being on this weight loss journey with me. At the, at the end of this video, I will be posting some pictures just like to show you my weight progress so far. And um, I'm hoping when the weight loss video comes out that – um. I'll have a lot more pictures to show because there is a lot I need to document. I got all my scale pictures, selfies, and just a bunch of other pictures I've taken. I know 2020 has been a difficult year. I haven't been able to go to Colts games or NASCAR races, but I'm hoping close to the end of 2021, back when when football se when the next NFL season hits and when the later season of the NASCAR season hits, I'll be coming out with some videos. Excuse me. <laughs> but I'm hoping 2021 will be better, and I'm hoping I can get, get to go to a few Colts games soon. And just make some videos because um, it's been kind of tough, especially with me being in college and all that. But anyways, guys, I'm rambling. I need to go celebrate with my family now. I just wanted to talk to you guys on here like I usually do for my New Year's video. So thank you guys for watching. Hope you um, have a happy and safe New Year's. Don't do anything stupid. Don't go drive drunk. Don't do anything like that. Stay safe. Please. It's, it's very important you celebrate New Year's safely. And not do anything stupid. So anyways, guys, happy new year. Have an awesome day. Thank you all so much for the, for the support. It really means a lot to me. I know I'm rambling. Until next time, guys, I will see you all. I've had a lot on my mind, I've had a lot on my chest I wear my heart on my sleeve, I wear my heart like a vest Work every day of the week, mm, they told me I needed some rest Want them to mention my name, whenever they mention the best Damn, it feels so good to be back, the one and only Had to take a step back, so I could learn in the 